What's up guys? SRC bringing you the Mass Effect 3 Let's Play. This is a game that I just picked up today. I'm pretty excited about it. I actually haven't played either Mass Effect 1 or Mass Effect 2. And so this is just the very first uh, game of this series that I've played. And so just let me know in the comments below if this is something that you'll enjoy watching. And if you want me to continue the series all the way through the game. And so... As you start off here, it's asking you to pick a role. You can do action, role playing, it looks like, and story. And I think that there's probably a pretty significant difference between these here, but I'm going to go ahead and go with role playing, which allows you to customize your character, choose dialogue responses, um, and then I guess you can change the combat difficulty level here. So, um,. I'm not personally big into customizing my characters. I care less about that stuff in all the games I play. I never have a lot of interest in that. But it does let you change your name here and all that good stuff. But I'm just going to stick with the default and just be John Shepard. And again, the appearance is something that I don't really give two hoots about. So I'm just going to leave it as the main appearance of the default appearance here. And so now we get to pick which type of character we want to be. And so there's Soldier, uh, which is a combat specialist, allows you to take down enemies quicker. Infiltrator, our tech and combat specialists. Uh, you can use a cloak ability to hide yourself and looks like you have a little bit better skill with the sniper rifle, uh, especially when scoping in on a target and kind of slow down time. And uh, that's interesting. So that's one I think I'm going to choose. I did play the Mass Effect 3 demo that came out on Xbox, and that's what I picked uh, previously. So Vanguard here looks like high risk, high reward combat, closing quickly on enemies, destroying them at range with weapons and biotic abilities. And uh, here are the different powers that we can choose from. Sentinels are unique, bringing both tech and biotic abilities to the battlefield. Uh, Looks like good in combat training and uh, doesn't need to take cover as well. That's probably a class that would be good for somebody like me who plays a lot of Call of Duty games and not real good at uh, taking cover. And Adepts are biotic specialists capable of disabling enemies with biotic power. They advanced, lack advanced combat training, are the best defeating enemies without firing a shot. Uh, it's probably not going to be me. I definitely like to use the weapons and fire weapons. And then engineers are tech specialists, the most effective class at disabling the defenses and the toughest enemies, incapacitating them, rendering them harmless. Probably an important skill to have, uh, but I think I'm not going to run that as my main. I think I'm going to go up here and pick infiltrator, and that's going to be the class that I like the most because we've got some grenades, we can cloak some good ammo now let's see here we can pick our psychological profile we can be earthborn raised in the streets on earth a colonist where we were born and raised on a border colony and looks like when we were 16 our family and friends were slaughtered and then a spacer where both of our friends or both of our parents were in the alliance military um, and our childhood was spent on ships and stations. Okay, so that's what I'm going to go with. And so let's see, Soul Survivor, through our military service, where things went horribly wrong. War Hero, early in our career, we found ourselves facing overwhelming enemy force. And let's see, the other one here is Ruthless. Throughout our career, we we're held fast to our basic rule, get the job done. You've been called cold, calculating, and brutal. I think I'm going to go as a war hero. Sounds like a good choice. Numerous. The deaths of numerous squadmates and friends have begun to play a significant role in Commander Shepard's psychological profile. Hmm. Kaden Alinko was killed in action as a result of an order issued by Commander Shepard. Only one survivor of the incident. And Ashley Williams. Gunner Chief Ashley Williams was killed in action as a result of my order. Only survivor was... Okay, well, I guess that's what we'll do. All right, so we've got our character all set up here. John Shepard, Spacer. Are we sure we want to do this? Yes. 
All right, let's get this going here. This should be a pretty fun game. I really enjoyed the demo. Uh, the demo, if you guys didn't play that, looks like it was probably the first level, I'm assuming, and then uh, another level that seemed like it was progressed farther along the lines in the story. Uh, but nonetheless, it was a lot of fun. I really have no idea still, even after playing the demo, really how to use these controls. So you'll probably see quite a bit of fails and a lot of different points in the game where I don't do really well. Um, but I'll let you guys listen to the intro uh, here. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. So it looks like Reapers are a sentinel race of machines that go around and cleanse the galaxy every 50,000 years. It's a nice piece of grass to play on there. Commander, you're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. Is that an iPad 3? Just threw it on the desk. Doesn't care about his things. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? Admiral? You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. Hmm, which one to choose? You know we're not ready if it is then. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the defense committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. We've all reviewed your report, seen the data you've collected. But it's all just theory to us. You've been there, in the trenches, fighting them. You know what they're capable of. Is that why they grounded me? Took away my ship. You know that's not true. The shit you've done, Whoa. any other soldier would have been tried, court-martialed, and discharged. It's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. That and your good word? Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Shepard? Kate? How'd it go in there, Major? Okay, I think. Hard to know. I'm just waiting for orders now. Admiral? Come on. It's a creepy look. Was he checking out my ass? You know the command. Who is this guy? I used to. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. 
The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. More powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But... There must be some way. I think we need to survive. Each of us has to be willing to die to save humanity. Anything less, and they've already won. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? The moon? It couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. That is a nice TV. Oh boy. It looks like the movie Cloverfield. Did you guys ever see that? Where there's just like random cutscenes of these machines just destroying cities. Why haven't we heard from Admiral Hackett? What do we do? What a weak man. The only thing we can. We fight, or we die. We should get to the Normandy. <laughs> Uh-oh. Look at this weak, weak man. Oh boy. That is a huge desk. Take this tiny little pistol against this yeah, giant yeah, reaper. Report in anyone. Major Alanko, is that you? What's your status? I can't raise the Norman. You'll have to contact him. We'll meet you at the landing zone. That is enough. Out the window. <laughs> All right. Come on, Shepard. Press R to display no, objectives. Let's move. Okay. Don't really know how to do that. Let's move. Why are we walking on the side of a building exactly? There aren't protected areas inside the building we could get there easier. Look out! Yeah, it doesn't seem real safe. So Alright, we're running. And we're going up here. Take a running jump. It's farther than it looks. Press and hold A. Okay. Bam. Come on, let's go. really sure this is the best way to go. Thinking inside a building would be a little safer. Come on. But uh, we'll have to you go know, this good way. thing there's ladders here for convenience. Just in case people want to walk outside this giant building. Looks clear, let's go. Come on, let's keep moving. Major, you read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're about five minutes out. Husks! Take him out! Oh, 
I think I have forgotten how to shoot. Thank you, though. Take him out. I'm out of ammo. Come on, we gotta move. No, I gotta kill this guy. Oh, another one. Yeah, look at that shooting. <laughs> Ladder. Okay. Oh. Man, I need the sensitivity to be boosted a little bit. It's hard to catch up to him. And I'm out of bullets. That's not good. We'll sneak up here. Striker. Oh boy. Looks like he's got a laser. Like he's peeing on us with the laser. That was convenient though. Very convenient. Okay, some a ammo would be amazing. Bullets. Oh boy. Hold B. I'm holding B. Through this way. The kid from the grass. It's okay. Everyone's dying. Get out of there. <laughs> Come on, you've got to get out of here. Take my hand. You can't help me. This kid's creepy. Shepard! Get here. Creepy. Shepard, forget about the kid. All right, he's gone. Good deal. Ah, this is a goddamn mess. Oh, dropping the the GD bomb. Every minute these machines are here, thousands of innocent people die. I won't be responsible. It's You're war. not responsible for the ones that die. We fight for the ones left standing when it's all over. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Where are we walking so now? <sighs> this is the way, time. huh? This random broken building lifting up pieces of metal. And they still just cut through our defenses. We need to go to the Citadel. Talk to the Council. The Citadel? The fight's here. It'll be everywhere soon enough. You said it yourself. <sighs> the Reapers will destroy everything if we don't stop them. The Council has to help us. You sure about that? No, but you were a Council Spectre. That has to count for something. Gotcha! Oh. <sighs> Thanks. I owe you one. More than one. More than one. Ammo! Win! Reload, let's keep moving. More ammo. Going Come outside on. again. It hasn't been that long since you've handled a weapon. Oh. Major Alenko, we're inside of the spaceport. ETA Yikes. Demon. Probably running at this thing wouldn't be the best plan. I don't know. Come in. Friendlies. 
Trying to contact our ship. No, there's one in the gunship, but it's gonna be crawling with those things. Stay here, son. We'll get you out of here. <laughs> Come on, let's get to that gunship. You got that's it? Come on. Easy peasy. Okay, he's apparently taking a break. He's just taking a little break. Gonna go get a snack. Oh, and that's uh quite convenient that the radio is just sitting here on the dock, on the wreckage. No big deal. Normandy, this is Anderson. Do you read? Admiral, what's your location? By a downed gunship in the harbor. I'm activating his distress beacon. Send support. We've got wounded down here. Major! Damn it! I lost the signal. Let's hope that beacon does its job. And fast, we've got company. Uh oh. That's quite the entrance. I'm gonna run out of ammo. That's not good. Ooh, this gun's got a little bit of recoil. Come on. Both. Yep, we're gonna run out of ammo. That's not good. Running out of ammo. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh yeah, got the pistol. Whoop, gonna start dying soon. There's more of them. And we are out of ammo. Right in the nick of time, buddy. Well, I think that's going to do it for episode one, guys. Let me know if you want to see more gameplay, more of this Let's Play. I'm going to be playing it quite a bit here over the next few days. Not sure how long the episodes will be. This one's a little bit longer than I had hoped. About 25 minutes so far. But uh, definitely leave a comment. Let me know if this is something you're interested in. 
um, because I'm going to be playing the game anyway, so it's probably not a huge deal to throw a little commentary on it and put it on YouTube. Uh, but if it's something you're not interested in, then I don't need to do that. I can just play it on my own as well. Uh, I know if you intend on playing it, there's probably going to be some spoilers here, obviously watching the gameplay play out. But, uh, you know, that happens. So just let me know in the comments if you want to see more episodes of this. There's a million more like them, and they need a leader. You're staying. We're in this fight together. No. It's a fight we can't win. Not without help. We need every species and all their ships to even have a chance at defeating the Reapers. Okay. Talk to the Council. Convince them to help us. What if they won't listen? Then make them listen. Now go. That's an order. I don't take orders from you anymore. Remember? Yeah. Consider yourself reinstated. It's not a little creepy Commander. that you carry that around with you. You know what you have to do. I'll be back for you. And I'll bring every fleet I can. Good luck. Good luck. You too, Shepard. There's a creepy guy again. Rescue ships. Oh, there's the kid. Oh, boy. Bad things are going to happen to you. Wow, what an episode. Got some, some cussing, some violence, some child deaths going on. What a game so far. Let me know what you guys think about this so far. I think it's a pretty good game. I'm actually enjoying it, so I'm going to keep playing it here. And again, don't forget to let me know if you want to see more. But for now, it looks like we've survived the initial invasion and are headed to the council to try and uh, get some more species to help us out in this fight against the Cloverfield Reapers.